Who's your best friend? Taylor Swift. And also Olivia Benson. Two-way tie. <laughs> Prepare to be amazed by the latest bombshell from Carly's World. We're about to dive into a revelation that's got everyone talking. And trust me, you'll want to stick around for this juicy scoop. Remember the dynamic duo of Carly Kloss and Taylor Swift? They were once thick as thieves, gracing magazine covers and lighting up Swift's legendary Independence Day bashes. But then, whispers of a rift spread like wildfire, leaving their admirers scratching their heads. Fast forward to last summer, and suddenly Carly pops up at Taylor's heiress tour in Los Angeles, setting tongues wagging. Now here's where it gets interesting. In a recent sit-down, Carly was put on the spot about her top Taylor tune, and boy did she deliver. Instead of playing it cool, she went all out, showering praise on the entire 1989 album. But if push came to shove, Shake It Off takes the crown. Carly didn't hold back, folks. She raved about Taylor's musical genius, dubbing her tracks classic and declaring her the ultimate showstopper. This unexpected gush fest has left fans in a tizzy, wondering if the ice between these former besties has finally thawed. The internet is ablaze with speculation. Some are convinced this is the olive branch we've all been waiting for, while others remain skeptical. After all, who could forget the infamous Junior Jules snub in Taylor's 2017 Look What You Made Me Do video? So, what's your take on this twist in the Carly Taylor saga? Is this the beginning of a beautiful reconciliation or just Carly playing nice for the cameras? The Let's take a deeper look into the friendship between Taylor Swift and Carly Kloss. Their connection began back in 2013, when they quickly became inseparable, frequently spotted together at various events like award shows and even going on vacations. However, around 2018, their friendship seemed to hit a rough patch when Taylor was notably absent from Carly's wedding. Fans have speculated that the fallout might be reflected in Taylor's songs from the Evermore album, such as It's Time To Go and Right Where You Left Me. Despite these theories, neither Taylor nor Carly has confirmed any tension between them. In fact, Carly advised fans in a 2018 interview to not believe everything you read. Fast forward to August 2023, and Carly was seen at Taylor's Eras tour concert in Los Angeles. An eyewitness at the concert revealed that Carly initially had a seat in the general section, but was later moved to the VIP area. She was spotted filming performances and singing along to hits like Shake It Off and Don't Blame Me. This event reignited rumors that their friendship might be rekindling. As for Taylor, she has remained silent on the topic of Carly's attendance at her concert. Whether or not her friendship with Carly has fully mended, it is heartening to see a sense of mutual respect endure between them. The internet is rife with theories about this development. Some fans speculate that Carly's recent public show of support is a gesture of reconciliation. Others believe it's simply a case of enjoying good music. Now picture Carly Kloss in this sea of die-hard Swifties, singing her heart out. It's more than just bopping to catchy tunes, it's like watching someone flip through a photo album of shared experiences. Could Carly's presence be a nod to the incredible journey she's witnessed Taylor embark on? It's food for thought, isn't it? By showing up at the concert and openly praising Taylor's work, Carly might just be giving us all a masterclass in rising above the gossip. It's as if she's saying, hey world, let's focus on what really matters the music and the memories we've shared. The Taylor Carly saga is just one chapter in the big book of Hollywood friendships. Remember the roller coaster ride of Selena Gomez and Demi Lovato's friendship, or the ups and downs of Paris Hilton and Nicole Richie's relationship that had us all glued to our screens? These stories remind us that at the end of the day, behind the glitz and glamour, celebrities are just people navigating the complex world of relationships. And while we're at it, let's play a little game. If you had to pick just one Taylor Swift song as your ultimate favorite, what would it be? Is it the catchy Shake It Off that Carly loves, or maybe a deep cut that speaks to your soul? Share your picks, and let's see if we can crown a fan favorite. Your thoughts aren't just comment fodder, they're the secret ingredient that makes these celebrity discussions so juicy and fun. Before we wrap this up, let's zoom out for a sec. We can't talk about Carly without giving credit where it's due. This isn't just Taylor's bestie. Carly Kloss is a force to be reckoned with in her own right. From strutting down catwalks to coding up a storm, she's redefining what it means to be a modern icon. 
Her code with Classy Program? Talk about using your platform for good. It's like she's building an army of tech-savvy fashionistas ready to take over the world. And let's not forget the unstoppable force that is Taylor Swift. This woman has reinvented herself more times than Madonna, and we're here for every single version. Country sweetheart to pop queen to indie darling. Is there anything she can't do? So, dear listeners, as we sign off, remember to smash that like button, subscribe faster than Taylor drops Easter eggs, and hit that notification bell like it owes you money. Your thoughts are the lifeblood of this community, so keep them coming. Picture this, Taylor Swift, the musical chameleon effortlessly sliding from one era to another. It's like watching a butterfly emerge from its chrysalis, each time more dazzling than the last. From the tear-stained guitar strings of Red to the synth-pop sugar rush of 1989 and the haunting whispers of folklore and evermore, Taylor's albums are like chapters in an epic novel of self-discovery and artistic evolution. But hold on to your hats, folks, because Taylor's live shows? They're not just concerts, they're full-blown spectacles. One minute you're in a glittering cityscape, the next you're in an enchanted forest. It's like Disney World met Broadway and had a pop star baby. No wonder Swifties are willing to battle ticket bots and empty their piggy banks for a chance to experience the magic. Now, let's talk about the ultimate fan sport, Easter egg hunting, Taylor Swift style. Imagine if Sherlock Holmes and Indiana Jones had a love child who was really into pop music. That's your average Swifty. These super sleuths are constantly on high alert, dissecting every lyric, squinting at every video frame, and analyzing every social media post. Is that a snake emoji? Must be a clue. Did she wear blue? Album 8 confirmed. It's like a never-ending game of Clue, and we're all here for it. But wait, there's more. Let's rewind to 2013, shall we? Picture this. The Victoria's Secret fashion show, glitter everywhere, and boom. Taylor and Carly lock eyes across a runway of feathers and fantasy bras. It's like a rom-com meet-cute, but make it fashion. From that moment, it was cookies and road trips and award shows, oh my. These two were serving up friendship goals faster than you can say squad goals. Remember when Carly played Baker's assistant at one of Taylor's fan meet and greets? Talk about a dynamic duo. These behind the scenes glimpses remind us that beneath the glitz and the glamour, celebrities are just like us. Well, if we all had designer wardrobes and millions of Instagram followers. They laugh, they bake, they have inside jokes. It's like watching the world's most fabulous reality show. So, whether your team they're BFFs again or team it's complicated, one thing's for sure. The Taylor and Carly saga is the gift that keeps on giving. It's got drama, it's got mystery, it's got more twists than a bag of pretzels. And that, dear listeners, is why we can't stop talking about it. Because in a world of carefully curated social media posts and PR-approved statements, these genuine moments of friendship, past or present, are like finding a diamond in a sea of rhinestones. Is this the beginning of a beautiful friendship rekindled, or just Carly tipping her hat to Taylor's undeniable talent? Drop your hot takes in the comments, we're all ears.